<laughs> oh, the hawk, are you? Welcome to Roverland. This is your friend Dano. And have I got something for you for an unboxing Saturday? Well, it's quite the little trip, I tell you that much. Um, yeah, we won't be unboxing too much. We will just be show and telling. Um, a couple of days ago, um, I went, uh, I took a day off and I met up with a friend of mine that I met um, on Facebook, I believe, uh, through eBay, no, through uh, the Roverland channel. Yes, welcome to Roverland. This is your friend Dano. And um, <clears throat> interesting story, totally bizarre. I'm going to put up a picture here. Here is um, Adam Betcher and his dad, Gary. Yes. And they are from the Minneapolis area. And um, interestingly enough, Adam, back in uh, 1998, was a photographer for the Camel Trophy, the Terra del Fagro. Yes, and our, an actual real live um, uh, photographer for Camel to Trophy. And oh, just it, it was an awesome meeting him. Um, what kind of brought uh, I guess this about is I had done a video a while ago about my brochures. You know, I collect anything and everything Land Rover uh, brochures and everything. Well, he uh, gave a shout out to me. And said, hey, I got some brochures for you. Well, it it turned out to be quite an adventure. <laughs> and so anyway, we decided to meet halfway from where I am, uh, where I am and where he is. We met halfway and that was Eau Claire, Wisconsin. And so we met and uh, dad, Gary tagged along and he, and he sold me some stuff too. And that's a whole nother video because we're not even going to get through everything here uh, uh, very well. Uh, I don't, I don't think, but anyway, we are going to be talking about Camel Trophy Team USA 1998 and Adam. So anyway, Adam, um, had some stuff for sale and, uh, first off we went with stickers, uh, adventure bags, adventure boots, adventure watches, uh, adventure wear, uh, picked up some of those. So yeah, I got, uh, a couple of those look at these big huge ones i got adventure watches and adventure wear uh and yeah just huge they are huge i can't wait to put those up so a lot of this has to do with uh camel trophy uh some of it doesn't like this i got uh, he had this this is from uh lrw land rover world magazine they gave this out as a promotional i may even have one of these myself but um, pretty cool stickers. So anyway, oh yeah, let me show you this one. He had a couple of faithful Rovers North ones. I had to pick those up too. Um, so anyway, so let's take a little trip about down uh, Camel Trophy um, uh, adventure. Yeah, so here's a pin that he, uh, uh, from the event that I picked up from him. It's just like a, a hat pin. And I kind of collect those, you know, and so, yeah, 1998. Uh, I would encourage you to go on the, the YouTube and, uh, um, yeah, pick, uh, uh, go, uh, search that, and there's a lot of videos out there. So anyway, um, I'm just going to go through this really quick. Just some of the brochures and things that he had that I picked up and uh, just really cool stuff. Now, these are, um, you know, this here are catalogs and, and stuff that, uh, you know, you could pick out stuff, uh, but, you know, you can't order it now. You know, this is Camel Trophy stuff, man. This is, but this is collector, collector stuff and uh, very, very cool. Um, yeah, just really cool um, adventure wear that, that you could uh, pick up and order just just awesome oh there's a dude in his underwear you could get camel trophy underwear and uh, dogs no <laughs> but anyway yeah so very cool so anyway so i um uh, picked up um that stuff 
But anyway, I was showing you this here brochure. This is one of the brochures, One Life uh, Live It. Uh, and uh, this is about uh, the Camel Trophy, uh, Terra Del Frago. And uh, this is, um, I believe this is just kind of one of their introductory brochures that uh, they gave uh, all the crew and everything. So this is not um, stuff given out to the general public. I mean, you can maybe find some of this stuff on uh, eBay and probably uh, pretty expensive because most of the stuff is pretty expensive. But uh, very, very cool stuff. Um, interestingly enough, here's, here's an interesting thing that I picked up. Now, uh, he was part of the, um, uh, you know, the uh, camera crew and stuff like that, the press. And this was a bag that they would put their stuff in. And you can see, you know, it was uh, this envelope contains photographs, video, uh, recorded messages, devices and stuff. And so I guess every day they would um, fill these and... Um, and um you know send them off and so then they could broadcast uh you know and stuff like that uh here's a lot of there's just some neat little stuff uh and you know and we talked and we talked and we talked and i'm not going to do this justice in just a small little video we're already uh six over six minutes on to seven minutes and i haven't even got to all the stuff but just these really unique um the flyers and brochures um, that he uh, sold me. So anyway, here are some photos that he took uh, that I bought from him. Here's the team. Um, here's a here's a really cool shot. Thought that would be really cool. Now this is uh, the trials um, that they did, I believe, in Sweden. Uh, they used the discoveries there. And here's uh, another one that the more trials and stuff like that. Here's some interesting stuff. Here is the event regulations for 98, the Camel Trophy. And it's just, I haven't had time to uh, look into this, but it's just, uh, you know, rules and regulations of what, what goes on and how things go, the rewards and stuff like that. Uh, but other things, here's a, uh, the Royal Geog Ge Geological uh, Society pamphlet that he had that I, that I picked up. Really kind of cool. Um, then the, uh, what is it? La Ruta Mea, uh, 94. Uh, he wasn't part of that. Uh, here's a neat, interesting uh, center lines. This was a Land Rover publication, July, August, 99. Um, just some really cool stuff in here. I really haven't got to go and look at this, but we're trying to talk about the trek here shortly and here's the Mondo Mea uh, another event that they uh, uh, talked about it, um, flyer really really cool here's an awesome and um, here is a uh, you ain't we ain't yellow <laughs> this is the 1990 uh, Land Rover Trek this is the one of the um, uh, official applications Dude, have you ever seen one of them, huh? Uh, and then here's another one. This is kind of cool. Feeling adventurous. This is the G4 challenge that was done in the States. Look, I got a CD and stuff. And um, this is August 8th, 2002, Salt Lake City. But uh, really kind of cool stuff. Um, so I got that. The other thing that he did when he was over across the pond is he took a tour of Soho, and I believe that they gave him this thing too. This is a quick little um, uh, brief history. Well, anyway, if you take the tour of the plant, they give you this uh, book uh, that kind of is a guideline of, uh, you know, what's going on, the cover story, uh, you know, the manufacturing, and I wish I, I had a better setup, but you're getting the idea here. The people behind it. These are just different tabs. Here's the sketch of the plant and uh, the old Soho site. And then uh, history of the vehicle and, and Land Rover. And then, real, oh, that is awesome shot. We like that. And 
And Adam and I, we really like that. And his dad is pretty cool. He's a he, what did his dad say? He told me that he bought the first discovery in Minnesota. These boys are from uh, Minnesota, the neighboring state to Wisconsin. And uh, yeah, he bought, his dad bought the first discovery uh, in Minnesota. So that was cool. Here's another thing that he had, uh, limited edition uh, dis discovery XD. I had a couple of friends that had uh, some of these and uh, that was always cool. And uh, here's another thing that I thought was awesome. Uh, this is my truck to have is the Defender 90. And so I had to have his sales brochure. Now this is uh, US um, and I, I might have one of these, but look at that, look at that truck. Oh, that's the gravy right there. So I picked that up from him. Here's another one. I believe I have this one, but I, I couldn't, I, you can't not buy something like that, huh? But we had an excellent time and uh, a great chat it was hot and it was sweltering you guys remember that shot huh but uh just just a good time um and uh here's another one uh this is the vehicle gear i don't have this this is something that uh really is kind of cool but here's that picture again is the, all the accessories that you could get for your land rover so this stuff is going to go into my, you know, personal collection. You know, I'm not going to get rid of any of this stuff. But um, awesome, awesome, awesome. Here is some, um, these are for um, media purposes, but these are UK. These are pictures that um, he acquired that are, um, would be sent to different media outlets that they could use. Uh, in their advertising and uh, just beautiful. Look at that heritage. That is a sweet truck right there. Look at that. That is a beauty. Here's another one. Look at that Defender 90. Awesome. TD5 110. Look at that. Beautiful. I love the white wheels on that. Anyway, so um, the other things that he had was when he was across the pond, he got some um, um, uh, English, England um, advertisers. Now, you know, uh, guys, this is the way of the Dodo Bird now. Uh, I've gone to the dealership. They don't hand out this stuff anymore. It's all online. So this stuff is, um, you know, collector's items. Now, you know, uh, not just Land Rover. Everybody, I think, is getting away from that. But these are A8 size. They're a little bit longer. They are not your regular, um, you know, eight by 11 size like we have in the States. But I got the Defender, I got the this one here. This is awesome. And just all kinds of neat stuff in here. And I just haven't had time to, oh, here's another one of that one. Uh, had time to look at them or anything. I've been really busy. And then he had some um, accessory catalogs. Look at that, That oh, that kind of looks familiar, doesn't it? Yeah, look at the background, huh? Oh, yeah, look at that. <laughs> Wonder what that is, yeah. So anyway, this is, I, I have a couple accessory um, uh, books here. Uh, here's the TDI. We don't have that in the States. Look at that picture. Look at that picture. Isn't that awesome? But uh, really some cool stuff. Here's a sec built on success. Now this one is kind of cool. This this has some really cool pictures of the Defender, the old country style there. Um, but yeah, just really cool. But now uh, look at that one. Oh, that is majestic. But this one here is kind of cool in that, um, well, not this one, the next one here. It, had, um, it has stuff in the back. Yeah, look at this. There's a back here and it, and it has stuff back here. Different stuff. Uh, uh, specifications so really kind of cool really kind of cool well I tell you what we're going on 15 minutes I got to wrap it up but uh, hats off to Adam and his dad Gary thank you very much we had a great day now um, Adam is is quite the uh, character he is the man he is the man and anyway so he's like hey Dan wait a minute I got something for you and he comes and he pulls this out if you all don't know what this is, this is a challenge coin. This is big and heavy. They uh, they do this. Uh, military does this. 
um, you know, different kind of um, challenge academies, uh, police forces, you know, they, they come up with these challenge coins. And so Adam Bircher Photography is, is his company and whatnot. And then uh, that's AB, AB there. And uh, really, really cool that he gave me this. And then I flipped it over and take a look at this. Come to find out, um, Adam and Gary and I, we are believers in the Lord. And we just like, are you kidding me? Are you, are you really a believer in, in the, you know, the Bible? And, and, you know, are you really? That is awesome. Just a different connection uh, going on there. And so we just... Uh, Wow, thank the Lord, and it was really kind of cool to meet up with uh, men of God and guys that love Land Rovers. So really cool. So anyway, I will have another video with Gary's uh, stuff that he sold me, an unboxing video. Uh, but I had to go ahead and do this one first uh, to get things going, and uh, we got to end on a positive note. Here's, yeah, I got a, quite a few of these, and these are awesome. But anyway, I got to get out of here. 16 minutes plus. All right, we're here. We're out of here. Thank you for joining me. Thanks to Gary. And thank you for Adam. Adam for uh, uh, providing, buy, let me buy some stuff. That was awesome. All right, I'm out of here. This is your friend Dano. Thanks for joining me. Have a great Saturday to get out there and have some fun. And remember, slow traffic, keep right, and have a great Rover Day.